Hello, this is Sophia Lydgel and we're the Empower Love Way and today I bring you the light language forecast for April and I wanted to talk about uh, last month a little bit because we're building on last month where March was the energies were as we move through the full moon and the equinox, the energy began to shift and transform and intensify. And so the theme for last month was facing your fears. And it was a lot about that. So bringing you back to the essence where you have, or we all have two choices. There, we live in a world of duality, of perceived separation, and yet we're unifying the perceived separation into a consciousness, into unity consciousness. Everything through unity consciousness, that, that awareness that you are a light being and everything ar around you is light, therefore energy and information, we are unifying that piece of what is perceived duality, polarity and separation, we're unifying it in the sense that everything that I see outside myself says something about who you are. Because ultimately your life is yours. The life that you're living, the reality that you're living, the world that you're experience, experiencing is yours and uniquely yours. Nobody else is living the same reality and in the same world because we're all unique expressions of the divine. And we're unifying this, realizing how we can be a divine being in our, through our human experience, through uh, this experience of duality. And so the Empower Love way is learning to empower our human experience as a divine being of light through love. And so the foundation of life to me is love. And yet in this duality, we have the opportunity to choose within that energy uh, frame. So we are able to choose to live from the energy of fear or from the energy of love. So the Empower Love Way, it brings you back to your connection with life itself, the energy of life that is sixth within you and empowers you in love constantly and gives you life and beginning to understand your relationship with this energy, beginning to trust the energy of life within you that gives you life constantly that is the life that activated your heart and continues to activate your heart is the intelligence of yourselves is the intelligence of all the world around you just how this system works in collaboration and cooperation and unity and love for life itself and the evolution and creation of life itself and so this piece about facing your fears on the month on the month of Mar March has been a powerful um, catalyst to coming into a deeper loving awareness. So you may begin to shine your light more truly to be who you have come here to be. And so April opens up the doors for that opportunity to express more and more who you have come here to be. For so long, we are um, we have been trained to be a certain way. And so there is a process of unlearning to tune in to what is alive within you. That is your own personal expression, your own personal truth. The truth will not be similar or, or the same as other truths because as I mentioned before, your truth is uniquely yours from the experience, from the observer and the awareness that you're coming from and what you're tuning in within yourself. And so this piece about last month was connecting more through the facing of your fears, connecting more with your authentic creativity with your authentic expression. 
connecting to your emotional body and what has been rising through that friction and through that facing of your resistance. When you go to the energy of fear and you face resistance and life brings you and that feedback of resistance, how have you been with yourself during that experience in your authenticity, in your expression of your emotions and the creation of that shift and that change. Life will continue to move and evolve regardless of where you are. So it's like you're pushing against the river or you're flowing with the river of your life. And so from that piece of facing your fears through your creative authenticity, it has been a process of really going inwards. There's some, um, life in that sense have inviting us to really be aware of our internal paradigms and mental structures and what's alive in your heart and what is true for you and what you value in your life right now and so through the eyes of um, loving awareness and experience that life is giving you the experience for you to learn your, about yourself, about who you are, discover and experience yourself, then you create who you are here on earth, your expression. And so from that, when you comprehend and you're able to see what you didn't see before, that's the transformation you only need to comprehend in order for that resistance to shift and flow to release it or dissolve it to activate something new or to dissolve into um, what was a block or felt like a block before that simply was resistance when you are able to see and comprehend why that is there then that dissolved on its own. So the awareness through the experience of, of facing your fears, facing your fears and activating a resistance, a moment of contraction where then you are creating in that expansion afterwards, you're activating a new frequency, you're habilitating a new frequency of awareness and existence within you. And that constant contraction and expansion is constant in life. Even look, you only have to look inwards into your heart that that, mo that process of your vibration a magnetic field is activated by the contraction of the heart and the expansion constantly. And so, that's a process of life. And so it's from that loving awareness and comprehending that there's nothing wrong in this moment, everything is okay. You're moving through an experience, you're understanding, this is an opportunity to understand yourself, comprehend something that has been in conflict creating resistance within you, now you can open your eyes to see and comprehend the energy in a new way and the way you were playing with that information, that energy and creating something in your life. But now you have opened that exp expression, that understanding into a new energy. And so, um, Tuning in to who you are from a space of loving awareness and seeing the world around you in love and appreciation. So I invite you to take a deep breath in in this moment. Just tune in into your heart center and just feel who you are. Experience who you are. All the aspects aspects of who you are in loving awareness simply hold space for everything that you are and that is alive within you in loving awareness and feel the love and the container that is all around you 
You can open your eyes and see through the window. See everything that is sharing this world, your experience with you, and that is here with you. In love and appreciation. So when we come to this level, we can see we're all here together in love. And so the other piece that I want to share is trusting more and more in who you are and the calling of your heart and your soul. That if that calling exists within you, it means that it's activating within you. This calling is activating within you. And the energy itself, as I was sharing, the energy of your life is there. You're not doing anything. Life invoked you. What it was created by flesh is in flesh. It was created by, by spirit, through spirit, is spirit. And you are both. And life invoked you here in the flesh and in the spirit, united connected, interconnected with one another. And so that calling of your heart, of your soul, trusting in the energy of your calling and trusting that all the pieces, all the resources, all the information, all the insight, all the expansion, everything is there available within the energy of your calling. So in that trust, you connect more and more with that authentic expression of who you have come here to be and express yourself more and more in the trust that you are here in this flesh body and you are here yielding the energy of spirit as well, the spirit within you and that it's all around you as well. And so in this process, you're connecting more and more with your personal power, with the freedom of choice and creation within you by knowing that everything that you are seeing and defining as good or bad is that your projection into the world. And so if you're projecting something as bad and negative or that it makes you feel bad or it makes you feel sad or angry, that's what you're projecting into the world. So bringing that feedback back into yourself and creating the choice of your own personal freedom and activating that freedom within you, activating your awareness within you, and activating your creation and just choosing again, seeing, okay, there's something out there that is activating the anger that is within me. What is it that what I'm seeing there that is activating the anger within me? What does it say about me? And now I have a choice. Is there a different way to see this reality? Who, who am I being called to be in this experience and in this moment, in my authentic create creativity and creation, in my authentic emotion and the truth of who you are, not for another, not because of what you should be or you think you should be or have to do, no, because it's alive within you, because it's the truth of who you are. And so with that piece, I want to end an exercise to help you throughout this month, because bringing everything through the energy of the heart, whatever is coming up in your life, I want you to bring it down into your heart and move it, the energy through your heart center. There's a thought, bring it down to the energy of your heart and just tune in to how it feels in your body. If there's something that is coming down below, you do the same thing. You rise it up into your heart and you move it 
through your heart. If you're projecting, let's say you're projecting that anger or that sadness or that passion, whatever it is, you do the same. You bring it and you move it through your heart. You move it through your heart and feel how the inside begins to come and the new levels of awareness begins to come as you move those energies of projection through your heart center. And so knowing that you have the power within you to transform your experience and to see the truth of who you are and give yourself permission and liberating yourself from past misunderstandings of fear. Tune in and begin to step into the energy of love and know the freedom that exists within you and that it's all around you, the energy of love, of life itself that you are and it's all around you, that is organized within your success and it works when you're in an alignment with your heart. So the month of April, it's all about being the truth, your authentic self, being who you are, being who you have come to be here on the planet. So I'm going to leave you with that and I'll see you on the light language transmission. Bye-bye. In itania, urin tu ishtia la cumbra e, in itoya la wan te eria toya dan, iria no ya la wan en ti ia coham, iria huam te ya la quam teria yada i ianei umnia quala quam, eria toya na quaya, unstia ya la kiareo, umtia ya la umnia dai, umtia ya shtia ya la kai, ubria quam le. Iane, 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 Omnia Kuayala, Enia Tuayane, Iria Tua Entia Istia Tuayal, Iria Tua Yampua Altia Ena, Inia Entia Entu Um, Omnia Onia Enia Enia Entia Yala, Iria Ne, Iria Um, Urum Ti Aya, Enia Ya, Estia Entia Umtia Ai. Iria tu nia te ala wam, ukua umtia estia tu ayakwam, iria tu ane, iria estia omia kua al, iria tu antia estia tu ayan, oria tu ayana, ku umpu ala, oia kua nene, ia tia antia ei kua am, hompia la kua antia estia tu ane, iria tu antia empia ua, Oria tua el tia en tia em, hum tua ala ku umpru u, unia tua yana, eri tia yana, ene si tia, o mia kua, o hia kua, alia tua, nia tua, nia tua, eri ta tua, shia ta tia na tika, tlake tia tua nin, iria tua yana kua na tia na aria te tia ta tia tua yala kua, ebria kua, m tia es tia ta yana, Inia ne nu mania hamnia nia 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 ne nia ro iria tua yala ne nia na inia na inia na inia na na nia na nia na nia na pria petia inia tua yala mia na hena 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 ina ina he umai. Inia he o mai, ua te, ua te, iria ne o poia le, iria te ama, ama he, ama he, ama he, china wana he, oh ama ha ha ha. Ella te ya hana wa hi 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 ya hama ne oh ma he ya ha 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 ha
hey anna taya ho unno tu ya hamma hai ni aata ye rasha o humma ya hanna hai o aata ya ha aata ha taking a deep breath in into the heart center mm.